Hey, welcome to Valhalla Predator Hunting. Uh, they'll be first of many videos to come, um, but today we've got some really cool item to unbox, so later on we could do the review on it. But today we're going to be unboxing the Lucky Duck Revolt Predator Call and uh, seeing what they have to offer inside the box. So without further ado, let's open this up. I've actually had uh, Fox Pro calls. I had the Fox Pro Inferno and the Fox Pro Hammerjack. Um, but I'm a firm believer in having more than one call in the event that one, you know, stops working when you're out on a call or when you're, you know, an hour from home or an hour from being able to get to a new call. So I'm a firm believer in having two. So here we are. This is my first Lucky Duck call, so I'm kind of excited to see um, all about it. Uh, it says here, directions for use, unpack the box, make sure all parts are present. Revolt electronic call, remote control, tripod stand, antenna, which is inside the handle, decoy, which is inside the handle, and it actually comes with a SD card inside the handle, or actually installed, I apologize. So inside the handle, it actually, there's room to store the decoy on it. That's actually pretty cool. Um, battery installation directions. And here it is. The call itself. It's a big one. It's a big one. Nice remote for it. I'll be interested in to see how it works. I'll take a break here and put the batteries in some of this stuff just so I can light up the remote for you guys and let you know what it looks like. Um, yeah, here it is. Lucky Duck Revolt. Man, this thing's a beast. It's, it's big. I'm looking forward to using it. Seems pretty well built too. Um, Okay, so this is uh, this is where the antenna and the decoy is. Here's the decoy that comes with it, and here's the antenna. Put this on here, and I'm presuming that the, yep, the decoy has a notch on it which matches a notch inside here and it's good to go um, here in the northwest it rains a lot so I'm kind of interested in how much or how waterproof this is going to be but um, it has really good reviews and I'm really anticipating using it, it feels like it's got a, like a rubber texture kind of feel on the on the handle here which is nice um, and then uh, some kind of rubber texture on top uh, it has an actual on off switch four different channels to pick from that you're going to run the remote off of and then it should also have an auxiliary for an additional speaker if needed. It's got favorite sounds, so if you just want to set it up, you can uh, program it for favorite sounds, F1, F2, F3, and F4. Uh, it's got a gain adjustment. Channel selector, like I discussed. Power indicator light, volume, pause and play. If you're just going to sit there with the uh, with the call right next to you instead of using the remote. Um, comes with the tripod base. And back here is the charging port. If you use a charger, uh, external speakers and an auxiliary plug-in, plus the SD card slot. Right underneath this nice rubber flap. 
tripod. Two piece metal tripod. It's actually really well constructed. I mean, I'm not surprised with um, the, the reputation of Lucky Duck. I'm just never owned one before. So there it is the Lucky Duck Revolt.